Because it is a huge occasion, the Champions League final. Who's going to be crowned Club Kings of Europe? It's Manchester United, they face Manchester City, and it's live right here on EA TV. Well, there's nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crown. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined as always on these big occasions by Stuart Robson. It's Manchester United facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, this is magnificent. The atmosphere inside this stadium is electric. Let's just hope the tension doesn't affect the players. It should do. Just look at the quality down there. This is the team Manchester United will go with. Look, sure starts. Oh, what an opportunity! and you can see why he's upset he got something on it but not enough to keep it out that's frustrating for a keeper Good use of advantage in United's favour. Mount. And he's got to clear his lines. They knew they wanted to apply the pressure, and they did. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. And you just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Keeper left us in no doubt that that was always going to be his ball. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. But they took care of the situation defensively. He's in behind. Well, you can see what he was trying, but too much height on the shot. Looking tentative, United regaining possession, made into the centre, and a no-nonsense clearance, oh he's gone for goal, tremendous block, now deciding to test the keeper, but no problems really. And then the accuracy department leaving a bit to be desired. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, big chance. And under pressure, that was a fine play. Holland. Possession one. Mount. He's in with a chance. take another look and you have to say the defending is so poor that's far too easy the keeper had no chance there well it's back to the drawing board I'm afraid Pep Guardiola's team have been really poor today so underway again and a 2-0 advantage here Yes. 
and support available. And a decent delivery and an effective clearance. They finish this really easily. They don't give the keeper a chance, do they? That's a good goal. On they go again, and United beginning to run away with this. play for a Manchester City throw in making a bit of headway Kovacic decides to shoot straight forward for the keeper he must dispose of it here Here's the replay. He's got such quick feet, hasn't he? Just look how he goes past his marker to get his shot away. That's a really good goal. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3 1 it is. Stones. De Bruyne now. Well, they have the ball once more. Holland and now Stones Silva United doing well to regain possession Sancho and over towards the back post well quite simply not precise enough from that position City unable to retain possession. Good piece of closing down. And a tidy challenge. It's a promising City move, but quick thinking defensively. As he runs at them. Dangerous ball. And a long way out. Well, the goalkeeper is thankful that it wasn't a better effort than it actually was. And three minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Kevin De Bruyne. On to Holland. Rashford 
possession one. He's in with a chance. shoulder and then throw on goal you never really had any doubt that he wouldn't slot that away it's a cool finish and the referee's whistle that will conclude the first half here at Wembley So the ball rolling again, and United very much in charge of this one. So let's see how the second half pans out. Kevin De Bruyne can keep the ball. Sancho. Delivering it. A strong goalkeeping after the corner had been delivered. Given away by City. He'll take this on. Well, we gave it the big build-up, but he didn't quite deliver on his promise. Holland. Greenish. Really good challenge. Bruno Fernandes. Is this the moment? And a penalty it is. Well, when you're behind in the game, you certainly don't want to be conceding spot kicks. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty, yes, yellow card, no. For Here's a change for Manchester United. to do it on his own and he's made headway it's still alive well it looks so threatening but the danger averted a credit to him for the challenge and the throw in conceded work from City to win the ball back and with a real chance well I don't think that 
great effort, remotely qualifies as respectable. And the reason it's off target, because the technique was really poor on that occasion. That's not a good effort. Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes has it. Anthony. Rashford. Well, there's defensive solidity for you. City a little wasteful in possession. Bruno Fernandes. Could be. Oh, that is a wonderful piece of challenging. Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. There's 20 minutes remaining now. Manchester United recovering possession well. Good looking sequence. Cross could be useful. Well, the post getting in the way there. And he's through here. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Silva. Plenty of support here. Didn't go as a plan in the end. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. Can he take advantage? Still alive. And you just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Goalkeeper has it. And he's in. It could be up for grabs. And a confident clearance. Just ten minutes remaining here. Quick thinking there. Sancho. Some of the fans are screaming, have a go. Well, a piece of quick thinking by the keeper. Well, that's great goalkeeping. He read it so well, didn't he? Well, Manchester United, all powerful. They've accelerated away in this one, Stuart. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity, and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Casemiro. Opportunity is in. Here it is, 1v1 against the keeper, and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. A glut of goals, 5-1 it is. Ericsson. We will have three minutes of additional time at the end here. Diesch. A bit wasteful from City. A real opening now. Chunk still on. Sound piece of goalkeeping. And now. Champions League red. Well, just look at the emotions out there. 
joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great thing. And what an achievement for them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Manchester United. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? These fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night.